In today's tutorial, we're learning how to make this text perspective effect in Canva all the way from scratch, and it doesn't have to take long. So let's start from Canva, and we're going to the elements section, and here type in container ship. Go to photo see all, and then just select any image that you like. I'm going to drag it on the screen, and I release it here, so we have that room with the space to work with. You can always use any other image that you like, that's up to you to decide. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new page, and here type in the text. So your Let's give this a different font, maybe Poppins, and make it bold. Now you can use any font or any text that you like. So I'm going to type in your text, make that as large, we have quite a cool design. Goes and I'll do some other words so that we can see what it realistically looks like. And then maybe a longer one in here, and make that smaller. So we have those text boxes, I'm going to scale them up a bit. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to share, download, make sure you select PNG, that is important, and select transparent background. Now, if you want to change the color, you can already do that here. You can always tweak it later, but it's easier if you, for example, want white, you already do it in white. Then download and do it with the transparent background. And of course, only that second page with the text. Download and save it. Now, once that is done, you jump back to the original image and drag in that PNG that you have created. You can see that now it's still that image, but with no background. So now we're going to give it some perspective. Go to apps and here we type in perspective. We want to choose this reshape app and then choose distort. And now we can drag the different angles and sort of position them however we like. So we just drag the corners until we have that position that we want. You can always drag the entire shape just like this and sort of put them on the edge points. Sometimes it's finding that sweet spot, but you'll get there eventually once you start to get the position right just like this it starts to get a lot easier. And then you can just tweak it. You can make it larger or smaller. Let's do it like this. Try to connect the lines with the boat so we have that sort of anchor point to go for. That always makes it easier. Now you don't have to make it as large as you want it. So you just want to have the perspective right. And once that we have that, we're going to click Save. And now we have this image here on the slide in that correct perspective. You can crop it if you want, if you want a smaller selection pane. Let's do that. And then we're just going to increase it and put it right here on the slide. You can even go overboard a little bit or you can make it smaller. That is up to you to decide. So let's put it on full screen. And this is how you can create that perspective text effect in Canva in just a few minutes. Thanks a lot for watching. If you want to learn more about Canva, make sure to watch the video on the screen right now.